Hey guys, it's John here. This is Garage. Hey. And this is Bernard Chan. Yo. Um, we are Space Y and we hope you enjoy your video. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Okay, hello. Hi. We're from Lodge International School. Okay. Hi. And this is my team and I. This is Brendan Chan and this okay. is John. Hi, John. Hi. Okay, so we want to work on a project yeah. which will help you solve problems in uh, your supermarket. Uh, so yeah. what are so we want to know what problems you are currently facing in your supermarket. Okay, supermarket. Yeah, we're talking about the supermarket is very big uh, area. So now I'm at the fresh market. So you can see there's a few items on the fresh market. Normally there's a, a problem that I can say problem if a customer going to buy uh, this uh, they are not, especially they go and wait put this plastic bag and then uh, take a long time. If there's no person or nobody know, know of my stuff available at the website counter, then uh, it's, it's, it's really take a long time. Then after that, we maybe create a bad experience for them during their shopping time in uh, in the supermarket. So if there's uh, any idea, good idea in the future, maybe from your three, three of you, if the better idea to uh, solve this uh, problem, they should be better. I really appreciate it. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. So okay. we will three of us will work on our on our way to solve your problem. Okay, that's good. And we will get back to you as soon as we find a solution. Uh, sure, sure, sure. Yeah. Sure. Thank, thank you. you. Oh, yeah, thank, sure, you. thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. After our visit to the supermarket, our targeted users are shopkeepers as we want to help them solve their problem with manpower. So we went back to school and started discussing our options and solutions to the problem. After brainstorming, my team and I is inspired by Zero Waste Stores. These stores are mainly operated by customers and cause a problem as customers do not know how to use the dispenser. Staff are expected to drop whatever they're doing in effort to help customers. So how do we solve it? With our dispenser, there is no need for such assistance from staff. And weighing sessions do not have to be constantly manned. Being fully automated and user-friendly, workers do not have to be interrupted while they're doing other tasks. Not to mention, our system is far more efficient than other weighing stations. Currently, the system will only dispense how much the user wants with a button, while calculating the amount released into the container. Place the container here. Now press the button to open the servo. Press the button again to close the servo. And the weight dispense will be displayed on the phone. You only need to press the button once, then again to stop. The system will calculate the distance and use an intricately crafted formula to calculate the weight that has been dispensed. For ease of use, the weight will then be displayed on your phone via Bluetooth. It's that easy! For our one month improvement plan, instead of using a button to dispense the food items manually, we intend to replace it with a number pad accompanied to Phenol CD so the customer can put exactly how much they want in weight or in ringgit. We will also implement a weight sensor instead of the ultrasonic sensor for increased accuracy. With this, we can also install a notification system to inform staff when it needs refilling. We will want to implement a receipt printer to replace the current Bluetooth system that displays the information.